This is primarily provided for your reference. However, I will highlight a few specific categories that I think will be helpful for you to understand. These are some of the terms that are referenced to frequently by fixed income market participants. We talked about the plain vanilla fixed for floating rate swap, where the exchange happens between two counterparties where one pays a fixed rate and the other pays a floating rate. Uh, another very important category that fixed income uh, rate investors refer to is a basis swap. Um, a basis swap is nothing more than uh, an exchange of cash flows where both sides are based of a certain, off a certain index. So in this case, uh, it could be a three-month LIBOR and a six-month LIBOR, or it could be a prime index and a three-month LIBOR, and so on and so forth. Uh, but the important thing is to realize that both cash flows will be resetting over the life of the swap with a certain frequency. Um, there are various uh, types of swaps that exist where um, the notional amount may change um, according to a certain schedule where it could be based off a certain index. Those are referred to as amortizing or accreting swaps. Um, there are also variations where um, payer may not be paying um, uh, periodically but could be paying at maturity. Uh, one or both parties could be doing that and uh, those swaps are typically referred to as zero coupon swaps.